These are the remnants of an ancient industrial harbour. Maritime archaeologists are investigating remains at Dreamers Bay off the coast of RAF Akrotiri in Cyprus. They include an ancient breakwater around 120 metres long, which was probably used to provide shelter for boats in Anchorage. The underwater team is made up of experts from the universities of Southampton and Cyprus. It's their third season trying to piece together the puzzle of these discoveries. Our main objectives of this season are to really consolidate what we've done. Um, we're trying to really nail, I'm not sure we're going to achieve it all in one season, but nail our understanding of the breakwater. It's big, it's like 120 metres long and it's covered in this seagrass stuff. And So we're trying to work out its construction and ultimately the date, which is it's really challenging us. Um, but we're also trying to understand a little bit more about this material which we're calling a shipwreck. It's just pottery concreted onto rocks basically, but it's all pretty much of a similar date, roughly around the 6th to 7th century AD. So whilst it may seem a bit sort of on the fringes for the general public, what we're trying to do is paint a bigger picture which hopefully is more engaging for people to sort of become excited by because archaeology is exciting and archaeology underwater is even more exciting. The, the landscape, both on land and underwater, is fairly pristine. I mean, obviously there is access by boat to, uh, to the offshore waters, but relatively speaking, for the, compared to the rest of Cyprus, there's very little activity around here because obviously it's monitored. So that does provide a big plus in terms of the archaeological preservation. Research also takes place onshore, where land archaeologists try to understand more about the surrounding area, which is thought to have been an important maritime crossroads. We're conducting um, academic research to understand what are actually um, mostly Greek, Roman and uh, Byzantine, that is sort of uh, Christian Roman remains. So we're talking about from around the third century BC to around the seventh century AD, about a thousand years of archeology, span where this was an intensely occupied area. And we're here at Dreamers Bay, which was an ancient harbor site. Um, and over there uh, was uh, a large number of uh, warehouse constructions along the seashore and down immediately behind me here was a small harbour which had an artificial uh, constructed mole built of great square blocks of stone which seems to have been an industrial harbour for exploiting the stone quarries which are away on, the, on this side of me. The project helps inform the Ministry of Defence and the Republic of Cyprus on how best to preserve the area for future generations. Sophie Kekoyanis, Forces News, RAF Akrotiri. Thanks for watching. For more from Forces News, like and subscribe to our channel.